Welcome to Cyprus introductional series of videos. Discover an island rich in history and culture, and full of wonderful experiences just waiting to be enjoyed. If you are heading to Cyprus, everything you need to know, information, facts, interesting ideas, history culture, accommodation, and housing market. The Cyprus Seasons Cyprus has a typical Mediterranean climate with long, warm and dry summers from mid-May to mid-October. The winters are mild and sometimes rainy, lasting from December to February. Short autumn and spring seasons fall in between. Cyprus is an island for all seasons. With over 300 days of sunshine, four distinct seasons and a mild climate, it is an ideal year-round destination. Every year, nearly 3 million tourists choose Cyprus as their vacation destination and many Europeans invest in second homes on the beautiful beaches and mountains of Cyprus. Cyprus offers a remarkably diverse natural environment for such a small country. In the same month, you can visit snow-tipped pine forests in the Trudus Mountains, drive through fields of olive trees and relax by the clear blue Mediterranean Sea. The climate of Cyprus never fails to delight her visitors, and every season has a charm and beauty of its own. In summer, sandy beaches and clear turquoise water beckon swimmers and provide the perfect conditions for sailing, skiing and all water sport under the sun. Yet a complete contrast awaits in the cool, pine-covered mountains of Trudus, with delightful hill resorts and traditional hotels. However sunlight on Cyprus is very intensive so it is easy to get scorched so some sunscreen creams are necessary. Once heat becomes weary you may head to Trudus Mountains. It is always cooler there. On tops of highest peak there are year-round ice cap. Among coastal regions Pathos is considered as coolest one. This concerns temperature of water too. As the land mellows in autumn there is a wonderful clarity of air on those balmy days, still warmed by the brilliant Cyprus sun. The sea temperature is still high after the long hot summer, and for some this is the best season of all. Autumn is great time to spectate seasonal changes of nature of the island. Also weather conditions are perfect for sightseeing. On rather small territory of state located numerous sites of historical heritage. And traveling between them would not take much time. At November weather spoils and most of tourists leave country but rather pleasant walks are still at disposal of those who decided to stay or visit Cyprus. The Cyprus winter is short and mild, with average daytime temperatures around 16 C. This season brings some much needed rain to the land, but most of its days are bright and sunny. And there is a short snow season on the mountains from January to March with fun to be had by all ages from tobogganers to serious skiers. During winter one is able to bask on a sandy beach and within an hour embark on a skiing adventure in the Trudus Mountains. At January orchids begin to bloom and at February meadows are covering with carpet of wild flowers. Meantime slopes of Trudus are trying on outfit of fresh spring grass. In higher regions snow cover remains from December to April. It is time for skiing. Combination of subtropical climate on plains of Cyprus and skiing on slopes of Trudus is worthy experience. In springtime the island takes on an enchanting beauty. The countryside is set ablaze as glorious wildflowers and fragrant blossoms burst into life to delight the eye with their stunning colors. Bright poppies, yellow daisies and pastel anemones present their myriad colors in the fields. Meanwhile prickly broom and rock roses decorate the hillsides, peonies start appearing on the mountains, and everywhere the heady scent of orange blossom pervades the air. In fact with 1,500 different species of flowers, Cyprus is a paradise for nature lovers. As the days lengthen and the sun gathers strength, Cyprus enters an idyllic season for walks, leisurely picnics and the fascinating contemplation of nature, not forgetting, of course swimming and sunbathing. 
From the gentle warmth of early spring to the golden sun-drenched days of high summer, there's a Cyprus season to suit all types, just as there is a special part in this island of contrast to appeal to all taste. The best time to visit Cyprus is the spring which often arrives as early as February. Weather is still favorable in March to April with wildflowers, including over 40 species of orchid, popping up across the ridge of the Bispamak mountain and the hillside towards the Akamas headland. The heat start to kick in in May and the sun usually lasts all the way through to October. Summer is the best time for sea turtle with conservation projects to be found on Lara Bay and Delegady Beach. Prices start to fall in autumn, so consider a getaway before the cold and rain of December to January. The tourist season in Cyprus lasts from April to October. During this time there should be no trouble getting flights and hotels, all the attractions, restaurants and so on will be open, and there should be numerous activities and festivals to keep you occupied. It is better to plan your excursions around the island for early morning or late afternoon to avoid the sun at its peak. Some hotels and restaurants do close in winter as there are not enough tourists around to stay open profitably. But there are enough places open everywhere in Cyprus for you to have a good time. In cities like Nicosia and Larnaca, you will find locals all out and about even in the midst of winter. Sun is still hot and water is warm so you can keep sunbathing and swimming. There is so much more to Cyprus than just beaches, there's a huge range of cultural activities, historical sites, pretty villages and gorgeous restaurants to be discovered. If you are wanting to explore Cyprus, or look into day trips from Paphos, you might find that Cyprus tours are cheaper during the winter months. With fewer visitors looking for tours and activities, you might be able to negotiate prices with local tour operators. When we visited Lachi Beach in the off-season we managed to negotiate cheaper boat trips and activities such as parasailing. Thank you for watching the video. If you watch all my lectures, you may be able to start investing in rental properties a little quicker. Please subscribe to my channel and press the bell to get alerts when a new video is posted. Please write your comments, questions, or concerns you would like to share.